The Sydney property market's continuing to rise for the fifth calendar year in a row, which is unprecedented growth. The question that many are asking now is how long can this continue? Today I've got with me Sydney's and Australia's best property expert in Louis Christopher of SQM Research. Louis, thanks for joining us. Uh, good to be here, Pete. Thank you. Louis, um, how has the Sydney property market performed in 2016 year to date and the inner west specifically? Uh, it's almost been a tale of two markets. So in the right. first half of the year, the market slowed down from the very fast and rapid rates of growth that we were having in 2015. Yes. You may recall back, if we go back to mid-2015, the market was rising at about 15 to 20% per annum. It was really a, a crazy time, if you recall. When APRA stepped in, that's the Australian Prudential Regulation Authority, mid-year last year to rein in investor demand, the market slowed accordingly. And it kept slowing through to the first quarter of this year. Then starting from the second quarter, the market started to pick up a little again, particularly in the inner ring areas such as the inner west. And now where we stand, for my read on the market as we currently stand, is that the market is certainly accelerating. Um, and when we look in the inner ring, it's accelerating quite rapidly once again. I would say the rate of growth now is running at a tempo of about 15%. Can we expect APRA to step back in again, Louis? If we continue to see very high auction clearance rates and that feeding through to very fast price growth on the official numbers, yes, we will see APRA step back in or in a worst case scenario next year, potentially an interest rate rise from the RBA.